my name is William Lopez. I'm it's 33. Yeah, I was uh, incarcerated for over 15 years to the juvenile system and the adult system. My last incarceration was, you know, over 14 years. And this uh, occurred when I was, I had just turned 18. You know, I pleaded to uh, involuntary manslaughter charge. And, and yes, being in the cell for 24 hours a day, you know, I had plenty of time to, to you know, think and, and really want to make that change. So what happened was, you know, I, I, lost, I lost my brother while I was there, you know, and you know, he was only 15 years of age and, and it all occurred because of gang violence. And so that further motivated me, you know, I didn't want to see my mother have to go through that as well. You know, another, you know, lose another child there in that cell, you know, I, for myself, I, I had to, you know, make a change changed the way I was, uh, I thought, you know, my, my thinking, my, just everything, you know, I got a close relationship with God, I, you know, and I started my education, I got my GD, after my GD, I got a, involved in college, you know, I got my first AA degree there in, in Iowa State Prison, and after five years, I went to a, to a different prison, a CRC, which is a minimum security yard, and I continued my education, I got two more AA degrees while I was there, you know, and there I was pretty much, that's where I met Scott and he pretty much helped me out. Scott Bundy's awesome, you know, he, not only has he touched my life, but he's touched so many other guys, you know. He, uh, like I said, you know, he helps individuals while they're in prison, once they come out with, with everything from, uh, you know, from, it could be job-wise, could be uh, just mentorship, you know, just pretty much support you all the way through, you know. And so after, you know, 14 and a half years, I came home, you know, and two weeks right after I got, I came home, you know, there's the uh, SB 260 was, you know, was still being uh, heard. So I went down there to Sacramento, you know, I talked to uh, legislators out there, you know, and told them about my side of the story. And, you know, and, and yes, I was there to witness the passing of, of SB 260. Uh, SB 260, what it does is uh, give kids, you know, with, uh, with a long enough amount of time, you know, the chance gives them hope to come home one day, you know, whether it be 15 years, after 15 years they get a review, 20 years or 25 years, depending on their sentence. And for me, you know, now I'm, I'm home, I'm trying to apply now to, uh, to LMU. I'm, I'm hoping, uh, you know, further my education, go to college, get a, my bachelor's degree, you know, and this is just the beginning, you know, I'm just great, you know, grateful to be home. You know, every day for me is great, you know, I'm, I'm so, Happy to be here.